My name is Rosalie Simon, and I was born in Velka Kriva, Czechoslovakia. One day, the police showed up at our house, and they told us to pack up our things and go get ready to leave, and we went to a ghetto. They put us in an attic with some other families. Children were crying. They were hungry. We were all hungry. One day, after about five weeks in the ghetto, they gathered us together again to the cattle cars. And it was traumatic for me to leave my family and be among a, a bunch of strangers without any food, without anything. We finally arrived, the train stopped, and they opened the doors, and selection started. After being in Auschwitz a couple days, I asked someone, what are those flames coming out? I used to witness them day and night, the flames. She said, you don't know. This is where your mother burned. I realized at my young age what Auschwitz is all about. A killing place, a place called hell on earth. I started to cry because I knew that my mother was heading towards the gas chamber and she is no longer alive. Time came where we were ordered to line up, stand in line naked, and one by one we had to pass Dr. Mengele. As soon as he saw me, he stopped me, put his hand on my shoulder, turned me around to look me over. He motioned to somebody to take me away. At that point, I knew that I was selected to go to the gas chamber. My tears were running down my face. There was a Jewish young woman who was helping Dr. Mengele with the selections. And she saw me and told me, run, run. She did that risking her own life because she wasn't supposed to do that. The young generation should be aware and be upstanders and not be prejudiced against anyone, regardless of race, color, or religion. Join the We Remember campaign for International Holocaust Remembrance Day. Write the words we remember on a sheet of paper. Take a picture holding the sign, post it to social media. Make sure that the Holocaust will never be forgotten.